I'll get things started with our Grace Ham, glazed in gray, sweet and spicy hot pepper sauce. But first, I will follow with a stuffed chicken with sorrel and cranberry sauce, and I will not allow Scrooge to interfere with my chicken. So I'm terrible, man. And <laughs> I will round things out with a juicy pot roast. But until then, I will be chilling out over here with my friends, our guests today, Angela Grandison Reed and Karen Madden. Hi. 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 Hello. How are you doing? I'm great. Once I'm in the kitchen, then I'm in my elements. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. Switch, Andre. <laughs> so I need for cook. Um, if I remember correctly, I won a little thing the other day, but we're not getting into that right now. Let me just get started. All right, so what we have going on over here, we have some water boiling. This is what we're going to use to make our glaze, the first glaze for the ham. All right. A whisk? Yeah. The first glaze is going to be a cinnamon glaze, cinnamon and brown sugar. And that will add a nice flavor beneath the sweet and spicy sauce. Yeah. And it will add a nice sheen as well. So Terry, I'm just going to ask you to stir that in for me. I'm going to hit it with a little bit of clove. So what we're doing now, I'm going to cook the ham skin on. So what I'm doing is just scoring it. And what will happen, this will allow more fat to run out okay. and it will become crispy. And stuff. Now, this ham is already fully cooked. So basically what we're doing is warming it through. Okay. And we're going to add flavor. Making it look sexy, eh? Oh, I'm gonna make it look real nice. All right, so this is not the first time I'm working with the Grace Ham. It's absolutely tender and juicy. All right, now you can leave it like this if you want, but my kind of extra. So I'm going to go in a cross hatch You're going pattern. to go the other oh, way. The yeah. Yeah. Okay. You have to do that, so. That's it for the ham. We're going to preheat the oven to 350 degrees, drop it in there. This ham is about, mm. about 12 pounds. So we're looking at What's that, 240 minutes? Yeah. We can cook and we can do the master, you know. You sure? How much hours is that? You just 240 minutes? minutes. Yes. yes. How much hours is that? So you divide okay. it by 60? Yeah. So you know the hour. Four hours. Maths. Mm. <laughs> guys. He, he got a calculator earlier, that's what he did. No, no. I'm amazing. <laughs> really? Look. So, matter of opinion. Amazing. We've been through this. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to ask Terry to just drop this in the oven for me. All right? All right. Now, I'm going to make a nice little dressing, vinaigrette, to go with the salad over here. So what we have going on here, apple cider vinegar. Real apple cider vinegar. Is, okay, is that organic? Yeah. Okay. yeah. Mm -hmm. We have a little bit of honey mustard here. If you don't have a food processor like this one that we got from Quartz, you can whisk it, all right? What you really need to do, mix all the ingredients except the oil, and you drizzle in the oil slowly while you're whisking. Mm -hmm. What that will do is emulsify. Basically, mm -hmm. it will combine the liquid and the fat without it separating. And that is exactly what we're looking for. All right, so I'm just going to start the process here. And you want to season this, all right? A little bit of salt, a little pepper. Close. All right, so we're going to drizzle this in slowly. I know our ham is ready to be glazed. You can glaze it maybe once or twice mm -hmm. with this base glaze. And then we're going to be using the Grace sweet and spicy pepper sauce. You can glaze that maybe like three times. All right. And you're getting it nice between the, cur the crevices. Everywhere. So that's, that's another reason we actually score it so that you get more surface area for flavor. So that's about it. We're gonna stick it in the oven. Yeah, just open that for me, please, Terry. Thank you. It will caramelize in about five minutes. Mm -hmm. If you want to glaze it two more times, you it every five minutes or so. However, I went ahead mm -hmm. and did one earlier today. Hey. All right. Wow. It actually Talk to looks me. so great. It looks like a rotisserie ham yeah. because you can okay. do that with the skin. It looks with awesome. The skin.
very I like the contrast with the cheese yeah. mm -hmm. and the purple onion and the lettuce balls. That mm -mm mean mm-hmm. No, that means no, she doesn't. <laughs> it's bad to well, cool. Let me try. Bad, okay. Let me try. Oh. I don't believe mm -mm. you. And the sauce, the nice complement of the sweet and the heat uh -huh. and, the, and the ham. Oh. No Christmas dinner is complete. This is a Christmas dinner must have all you viewers out there. I don't mm. like it. <laughs> it. It shows on your face. Why am I not surprised? It shows on your face. <laughs> so here what? I'm going to pretend like I'm not enjoying 